This video is about Grandfather Mountain. Hey there, my name is Mariana, and I'm also known as Salvi Nomad. I love to travel and I love to hike in different places, and these are my adventures. So one of my cousins suggested that we should hike Grandfather Mountain, and I saw pictures on Instagram and said, absolutely, let's do it, I'm on my way. If you're hiking, you park in the lower lot. The upper lot is reserved for people visiting the swinging bridge. Well, that added an extra 0.8 miles round trip to our hike. The trail to the upper lot is easy to follow even though it's unmarked, and there's a small store and restrooms at the second lot. We crossed the parking lot to the trailhead and filled out our permits. They have half a dozen signs letting you know that you need to be back to your car by 6 p.m. Otherwise, they send out a search party. From the beginning of the trail, we followed the blue trail markers all the way up. This crazy woman right here. Think, well, she thinks we're gonna make it up there. I 100% I guarantee you'll make it there. You guys have the dedication. So, we're trying to go up there. Bruh. She's a psycho. <laughs> Dude, not for nothing, that's how I felt when I first started hiking. I was like, I can't do it. And then you get there and you're like, oh shit, I did it. At this sign, we kept following the blue trail. And I'm giving you fair warning now, we stopped for so many pictures. We ate snacks and drank water at Grandfather Gap. I knew about the ladders we were going to encounter, but I didn't know we were going to also have to climb a cable. Super helpful but still really scary ladders. Don't mind us, we're just gonna climb a random ladder that's lodged between two massive rock walls. No biggie. I don't know if it was that we wanted to take pictures of everything or we needed breaks, therefore we took pictures of everything. On the way up, there was actually nine ladders total that we had to climb. Bruh, look at this shit that I, we are climbing. This is the look your cousin gives you when she can't believe you have her on a mountain. But it was her idea! Honestly, I love my cousin so much. They put up with me and going on these adventures and they went on this mountain, they completed this hike with all these ladders and I saw the look of fear in their eyes a couple of times but they are hardcore. Vanessa, was that easy? No. Would you that do it again? Easy. No. <laughs> First and last time. Nana, would you do it again? Love the tree, bro. No, but it was it was it was good. It was good. <laughs>
As we kept going up the blue trail, we spotted a ladder in the distance. That would be ladder number 10 when we decided to descend later. Here's the ninth ladder to the top, and we finally made it to McRae Peak. It was getting late and we needed to be at the car by 6 p.m. Time to go down. At this sign, we made a left. We followed the yellow trail markers. And here's a ladder we had seen from a distance earlier in the day. We took the red trail to bypass the upper parking lot. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it, please like, subscribe, and comment below. Bye!